flirting. <laughs> flirting. The art of flirting. Same. It All happens day. every day. Men and women do it every day. What if you could have a little help, though, with your flirting? What if you could just walk down the street and let your perfume do the flirt for you? The men part like the Red Sea right there. The new scent promising exactly that. It's going to attract everyone to you. Early show contributor Taryn went to Brill, put it to the test. As I like to call it, muskin up. <laughs> <laughs> muskin up. That changes everything, Mark. <laughs> Good morning to you both. Well, it's a new perfume called O oh Flirt. Build is the world's first perfume clinically proven to make men flirt with women. Thanks to a very special combination of key ingredients like pumpkin and lavender, it's a pretty interesting idea, so we decided to sniff it out. Sparks fly. Meeting the perfect man. Falling madly in love. According to the $23 billion a year perfume industry, one spritz can make it all come true. If that sounds like an empty promise, well, what if they could prove it? This is a flirt. Great. And this is the perfume that flirts for you. Meet Sean Hathi Romani, co-founder of O-Flirt, billed as the world's first perfume clinically proven to attract a man. It's not just a fancy picture and a bottle, it can actually make you feel uh, differently and actually change the way that you're perceived by others. But you say there is science behind this. We've also conducted kind of clinical studies uh, to kind of figure out what kinds of scents and aromas really uh, get guys excited. The research shows that scents like lavender and pumpkin, both found in O'Flirt, nice. would help That's lure that clean. special someone. Like Rochelle Bloom of the Fragrance Foundation admits it's clever marketing, but as for accuracy... My reaction is, show me. Show me the money. Uh, I want to know how it can work. Smells like a challenge. So we decided to do our own unscientific sniff test with O Flirt on wrist A and a popular classic Chanel on wrist B. Which one are you attracted to more? I think I'd have to say A. Something about B. I, I can't describe it, but uh, I like B a lot. I like a A one. You're attracted to yeah. A. 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 Yeah. A, of course. A, of course. No question about it. Among men, choice A, O Flirt, was the clear victor. Better fragrance. Smells nicer. Why does it smell nicer? More feminine. It has a, uh, an aroma that this, it catches me. It had more of a clean smell to it. To me, it's like a garden of roses. Yeah. I have no clue. <laughs> <laughs> like a meadow. Like I'm in a fresh mountain. Like I'm in nice. fresh air. I'm gonna cry. Yeah. <laughs> in the fairy tale world of fragrances, we find little truth. And while O'Flirt's claims might not be pure science, there's definitely something in the air. Now do we start kissing? <laughs> no. no. <laughs> no, we don't. No kissing. It was, I, I would love to know how many times did some of those men say, wait, can I smell that again, Taryn? It was, we did a number of takes, let's put it that way. You do smell like a man. <laughs> Thanks. You know what it I might be? Bacon. Right. My husband came up with a revelation a couple weeks ago. We were <laughs> sitting at bacon. brunch. We had no children with us for the weekend, right. and he said, bacon. They should make that into a perfume. Interesting. <laughs> I will not be wearing bacon yeah. perfume, Could be onto Dave. something. Bag. Good luck with that. Thank you. I'll need, I will need it. I will need Karen it. Karen has eight <laughs> dates this weekend. Yeah, nine. Nice no. job.